Foot and mouth disease is infectious and sometimes fatal. Mm. Is a viral disease that affects animals like cows, sheep, goats and pigs that causes a high fever and blasters inside the mouth and on the feet. Mm. Following the outbreak of the disease in Kalamoja in 2014, Veterinary doctors put a quarantine on the slaughter of animals and sell of the meat in the area. They also put a ban on the movement of the animals and the sharing of watering areas. This had a negative economic impact on the locals and the government in terms of income and revenue. People are reluctant to treat the animals because they view these animals as a, not wealth but as companions. <laughs> When the disease was detected again, the government and the UN's Food and Agriculture Organization came together to design a rescue program in which all animals in the seven districts of Kalamoja will be vaccinated to avoid last year's scenario. It's in combination with other um, components that we have in terms of providing water facilities because we plan to provide at least 38 you know, valley dams and other you know, water containment uh, facilities in Kalamoja. The State Minister for Animal Industry, Bright Ramilama, and the country fowl representative in Uganda, Al Haji Jarul, launched the vaccination exercise which targets over one million animals. Ramilama was concerned that there will be adverse effects for the country if the disease is not well handled. Ramilama said the aim of the vaccination exercise is to strategically control the transboundary animal diseases in Kalamoja, which is expected to reduce the impact of animal diseases on pastoral livelihood and strengthen their resilience. When we get outbreaks exceeding more than five districts, then we know it's really uh, threatening to be an uh, epidemic. And we are hoping that uh, we could at least uh, get additional funding uh, from our partners to continue. This program will run for three months. Ivan Chumulchigozi, NTV. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.